you all take it apart. It's gonna have this old fabric on it. Then it's gonna have like a little cardboard. But the cardboard gonna have like this nasty like stuff on it. Like glue and stuff. So what I do is just take a little thing, same thing, clean your shoes with this. So I can keep the same shape. Scrub it down real quick. Do it outside so you can have like a well little area to um because it's nasty. I don't know if it's toxic or not. I don't got my mask, so I can't find it. So just do it outside so wind blow it, blow with it. Boom. Knock all of it off. So you can get ready for the um the new glue and the new fabric that you're gonna put on here. But uh, I'm doing a Chevy symbol, so I gotta um I put the Chevy symbol on it before I get to the other side. Alright, I'm back in the room in the little booth. Um, so I already got marked up how I want the Chevy sign to look on the little window. You open it up, it's real dirty. You know, you gotta clean that. That's cool. But, um, got these cleaned off. I might replace these because you see how they looking. Bogish. This ain't nothing but some cardboard. Some real thin cardboard. Um, still want to clean them up so when I get the, um... The new one, I can have something to trace it off of so it can be marked up right. Um, so I just want to show y'all real quick. I'm going to have this in the middle. Um, this is something new. I ain't seen this yet, especially not in Chicago. I really I really haven't seen this. Um, somebody put a um, laptop monitor um, in the middle of a thing, hook it up like a regular monitor. Man, that's a decent little size, a little laptop monitor. Um, waiting to get the pieces to finish that off. Fiberglass that in the dashboard. But let's get back to this. Um, what I'm gonna do is um, basically take some clay, mark up how I want it to look, the right size, everything, the clay, do it, and then when I put the new fabric on there, yeah, have like the shape in there. But I might fiberglass or just bondo over the clay so it can have that shape but the clay is going to be like a, a template most people just cut it out of wood but since clay like easy to shape up and do what you got to do with it i'm gonna just use the clay all right i'm back in the room in the little booth um so i already got marked up how i want the chevy sign to look on the little window you open it up it's real dirty you know you gotta clean that that's cool but um Got these cleaned off. I might replace these because you see how they looking. Bogish. This ain't nothing but some cardboard. Some real thin cardboard. Um, still want to clean them up. So when I get the, um, the new one, I can have something to trace it off of. So it can be marked up. Right. Um, so I just want to show y'all real quick. I'm going to have this in the middle. Um, this is something new. I ain't seen this yet. Especially not in Chicago. I really, I really haven't seen this. Um. Somebody put a um, laptop monitor um, in the middle of a thing, hook it up like a regular monitor. Man, that's a decent little size, a little laptop monitor. Um, waiting to get the pieces to finish that off. Fiberglass that in the dashboard. But let's get back to this. Um, what I'm going to do is um, basically take some clay, mark up how I want it to look. The right size everything the clay do it and then when i put the new fabric on there yeah it had like the shape in there but i might fiberglass or just bondo over the clay so it can have that shape but the clay is going to be like a, a template most people just cut it out of wood but since clay like easy to shape up and do what you got to do with it i'm gonna just use the clay all right so this is what i got so far y'all I got this, um, the window, window, <laughs> no, it ain't, the, um, little thing, right there, took this one apart, came with the little thing, cleaned it off for y'all, um, did some little shapes, probably fiberglass that later, the little Chevy symbols, put that right there so it can be like the little 
fabric. The Chevy symbol sticking out a little bit. But um, use clay because just to get the shape, most people would have probably cut it out of, I don't know, cardboard or wood. I had clay laying around. Got the whole little setup. Made it real nice and smooth. It don't matter what type of clay you use. Clay is clay. You can even use the little clay that little kids be using. Um, but yeah, I got some clay from my art stuff. But basically, smooth the clay down. Put it on there. Cut the shape out. Put it on there. Smooth it out. Put it on there. Cut the shape out. I did that about four times. I don't know if you can see that. about four times to get a decent like layer and instead of trying to shape it out by hand I just did the first shape cut it out and then kept putting it on top and just cutting it then pushed it down um this is a little smaller than this one but they basically the same size so I got that going um next step trace that out next step is basically so, um, get the fabric I need so I can um, go ahead, probably um, get some more material right for right here, get the fabric, fiberglass it, make sure it stick over here, put the fabric on there, and that's how it's going to look. But just imagine that with fabric on it, looking right. <laughs> So check out my video part two when I get all of that. Holla at me.